Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Tuesday, August 11th, 2020. Free pick in baseball coming up on this report. Hey listen, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com and just want to give it a trial run, all you got to do is click on that link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account, and then you can use those free $60 bucks on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. All right, uh, listen, we've got one lined game in the NBA as of 4 a.m. Eastern time. Happens to be my premium pick over at DocSports.com, which you'll be able to grab on Tuesday morning. Been given out and playing, betting one NBA play per day. We've won three in a row over the last three days uh, and also six and two with our last eight. So we're going to look to extend those runs to four and oh and a seven and two uh, with this play on Tuesday. So be sure to grab that over at DocSports.com. Also involved with the baseball side. I think we've got some really serious value on one particular road team in Major League Baseball on Tuesday. And yeah, that's also available Tuesday morning Doc sports.com. All right, let's get to our free pick for today. We're going to look at a, a matchup between the White Sox and the Tigers. We're going to recommend to play on over nine. And right now the juice is around minus $1.20 on the over. We got this matchup between Gio Gonzalez and Ty Alexander. Alexander has uh, made, what, five appearances thus far. This will be his first start. And uh, if you look at what he did against the White Sox last year, he faced him four times. Got knocked around, 18 and two-thirds innings pitched, so a little bit more than four, four and a half innings per start was all he averaged per outing. Uh, 530 ERA, buck 82 whip, and a batting average against of 365. So I think they'll be able to get to him here. Don't know how long he's going to be in the game, but I do believe they'll be able to get to uh, Alexander. And as far as the White Sox, Gio Gonzalez struggling right now. Uh, we know his numbers will get better, but right now a 231 whip, a 364 batting average against. And here's the kicker. He's got an ERA of 771 in his first three starts thus far. It would be over eight if Kansas City could muster up a couple of the runs with guys on base. He went three and two thirds against the Royals. He gave up eight base runners in that particular outing, but KC couldn't figure out how to cross the plate. He obviously gave them plenty of opportunities. I think that's going to be troublesome for Gio in this particular game against Detroit. And the one cool thing when you're playing the over between these two teams in this game is the fact that when it counts the most, these two teams are are both in the top 10 when it comes to runs per game so far this season. So I'm going to recommend to play on over nine to get the juice right around minus a buck 20 as I cut this video. That's between the White Sox and the Tigers. Check out my Tuesday over at DocSports.com. NBA, Major League Baseball, NHL gets underway, uh, but we're going to wait and get through this first day of NHL best of seven series. Like to see how goalies are looking, like to see how teams are playing on the defensive end of the ice uh, before we get involved with the NHL best of seven series. So we're going to take today off from the NHL and watch and observe, build some data, get ready for game two in each one of these series that begin on Tuesday. So that'll be it for us for today. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com.